Welcome to DTV. I'm joined by uh, new demon Christian Salem, who's uh, been selected at number nine. You were the first Melbourne pick for tonight, and uh, congratulations, Christian. What's it like uh, donning the red and blue? Thank you very much. Um, it's amazing. Uh, still speechless. Um, I n sort of knew it was sort of in the range, and I was just looking at Melbourne. I was just stoked to end up there and getting my name called out and coming across and meeting Ruzi. I was just speechless and can't wait to get to the club and meet the boys. When you met Ruzi, what was his uh, first words to you? Yeah, I first, first met him at draft camp. But I saw him up on the stage and just said, welcome, g'day. And my dad owns a couple of restaurants and he said, looking forward to the free feed. So got to look after him. How's the day been for you? Um, it's been all right. It's been pretty busy in the uh, morning, but I just sort of relaxed by the pool in the afternoon and getting ready for the draft and a bit nervous to see where I ended up and just stoked to be a demon. Where did you think you'd end up? Um, I sort of knew around this range. I didn't know Melbourne, but I sort of knew Collingwood or Melbourne. So um, as soon as I got my name read out, I was just stoked and so excited. In your own words, uh, talk about yourself as a footballer. Yeah, um, obviously I think I'm a hard-working footballer who I like to see myself as uh, respected and respectful towards people. And um, yeah, just sort of in it to do the hard work and get the best out of myself and put the team first. Yeah. What about your sort of football journey? You've had to, you know, obviously work pretty hard to this point. Uh, when did you sort of, you know, set the goal of playing AFL? Um, I guess it's sort of everyone's dream growing up is to play AFL. And even back in Auskick, I still, still remember thinking, I want to play AFL one day. And I'm um, getting the opportunity now. I'm just uh, so grateful and really humbled to get given the opportunity. What about the family? What's, uh, what's their reaction? Yeah, they were very excited. There's obviously got about nine of us down here, so... Um, they're very stoked, especially mum and dad, because they're sort of, and my brothers and sister, they sort of wanted me to stay in Melbourne. And um, as soon as Melbourne got read out, and as soon as we heard that Melbourne had a chance, we're just wrapped and just so hopeful. And yeah, got the opportunity. Now, of course, you're a Melbourne supporter now, but who, who did you bury for? I uh, buried for Essendon. My best mate who I brought up here goes for Melbourne, and I think he was about to pass out. So, yeah, so he's over the moon. Yeah. What, what was his uh, reaction when he found out his, uh, his best mate joined the Ds? Yeah, I didn't even think he was going to make it to the pick. He was so nervous and excited and um, just sort of gave him a little fist pump when I was going up. And Yeah, he's, he's a great guy, so pumped. Well, great to chat to you, Christian. Well done. Uh, fantastic achievement. Uh, obviously, the hard work starts, but it'll be uh, great seeing you watch uh, your career unfold with the red and blue. Thank you very much. Thanks for having me. Thanks.